Hi everybody, it's Celine and Titch. Hello. From I Am Handmade and we're back from our holidays. Woo. No, not woo. Ooh. However, we decided to bring sort of a little bit of our holidays back with us. And um, when we were out driving, we saw um, basically a scene sort of below us. We were sort of coming down from a hill. Mm. Um, and there was an incredibly blue sky, like like some of the Mediterranean. And in West Cork, which is where we were in Ireland, there are a million of these tiny little orange flowers growing in all the hedgerows. I think they're probably self seed or something, but they're stunning and they make me really happy. They're just such a happy, happy colour. So basically we decided to do two colours for our soap today, which is the bright orange of the flowers and the blue of the sea Ooh. and sky. The sea and sky were both the same colour, handily enough. <laughs> so um, the fragrance oil we've used is sort of a, it's a nautical sort of fragrance, but it has hints of slight citrus mm. and we boosted that up by adding um, uh, fragrance oil that a lot of the US people will know, which is energy from Brambleberry, which fortunately provide all their um, uh, paperwork so that we can use it here which is very handy so in here sorry no I was gonna say, do you actually know the name of those orange flowers Are they no confusion? no no I don't know yeah, I was curious <laughs> and we didn't get a picture because where we were stopped is a very narrow little road and we couldn't stop to take the picture but I'm gonna look on the, on the internet later on because I'm sure somebody somewhere will have taken well, a picture well I have some pictures of the orange flowers but I just don't have any with that blue, blue. I had Together. blue and Um, this is our milk and clay mix. A little bit stodgy because um, I didn't put enough water into the clay and I sort of clagged it up on me now. But no matter, it's all going to be blended in here anyway. So this has the triple milks again. Buttermilk. Go on. Um, goat's milk. Yeah. Oat milk. No. Coconut milk. Coconut. Oopsie. We did have a little. S oh yeah. I don't know if we tried it again with the <laughs> I did have a little start before and I tried to make lye water with oat milk and I went a bit like that. Looks all gloopy and mank. So. <laughs> so that's why that's in a jug over there waiting to be disposed of. <laughs> that's what hobby jobs are for. So this is white clay as Titch says oat milk no not oat milk <laughs> goat milk Coconut milk and oh, butter milk. Um, we're talking together. Yeah. <laughs> and just want to say, while we were away, I'm so glad lots of people missed us because that's kind of cool. Well, they missed you. I haven't run anyone. No, that no, me. there were sorry. <laughs> apologies. There were a couple of comments saying to us both, oh. not just about me, obviously. So you didn't even bother saying that. <sighs> you know, you kept it all about you. Well, you know me. You're the most important. I'm the most important. Well, in my mind anyway. <laughs> so that's a bit gloppy but it's okay because we're going to stick blended and especially for Renee because I know she missed this burp, 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 burp. <laughs> Because it was so gloppy. Gloopy. That's gloopy. Cool word. Gloopy. That was more of a glop. Literally, it made a sound. Glop. Okay, this is the lye water, which is 100% aloe vera, and we have um, silk in it. Yeah. yeah, but I also put that. Oh god, I can't remember the name of it. Very scattered oh. lately. <laughs> Stuff that hardens bars. What the hell is it called? Powder fire. Huh? Slitter fire. No. Fire. No. I don't know. <laughs> I look it up. I know what it is. Everybody, everybody watching this shout and goes, you idiot, lean. Anyway, the fragrance oil's in here already. It smells really good. I'm to get all of that out. What is it called? I have no idea. I want to say sodium citrate, but that's not right. Zinc oxide. No, that's whitener. Alright. 
I'm just shouting off random things. Yeah. I don't want to over mix it. <laughs> Malky's home from holidays too. Hello Malky. Hello. Hello. So <laughs> that's sufficiently mixed. That's lovely. <laughs> So we put the color in the colors. Scoozy, scoozy, scoozy. And I will remember this time to take the teaspoons out because one video ages and ages ago I forgot to take the teaspoons out and I mixed the teaspoon in, which is very clever. Lovely silver finger. Gave Titch a lovely good big laugh at me. I didn't even notice myself till the video on your shoulder. So I'm doing this half and half. Yeah, both of these fragrance oil I believe behave beautifully so we shouldn't have any major problemos. Fingers crossed and all that. Mm. Blend these in onto the orange first. Ooh, Big bubble. I'll just keep doing that now until I stop. <laughs> I was just holding the jug there and I thought, oh gosh, that's gone really hot. Is and it? I just realised, no, it's my hands. <laughs> <laughs> it's really warm here. I'm sweating. You're such a silly goose. I know. <laughs> it's totally, it's ridiculously warm here. It's probably so wet today and it's lovely out. It's a little bit on the green side, but actually... But that's not bad because it's the water yeah. is really green. So. The energy has a, a sort of a yellowy tinge to the oil, so... That's pretty nice. Happy with that. Good stuff. That's actually really nice. It's lovely colour. Aqua. -y. Furry. Aqua. -y, yeah. Aqua. -y. It might stay that. It might go more blue. Okay, I'm going to move everything over here and follow you. Now, I've got this idea. Um, I'm going to use my spatulas. Now, okay, so we're just, I'm just mixing these up just to make sure they're fully mixed and I think I pour the bluey green at the bottom of the mold. Are you just pouring these and then doing a I'm spice doing the Celine swirl on this? It's world famous now. <laughs> well it's kind of funny that other people have been it doing it. It looks more aqua y um, off camera than on camera. There's more bluey on here. But it? it looks like the blue we saw on camera, but it's actually a lovely sea colour um, off camera. So it's nice. But why does that? The lighting is different. I don't know. It always seems to be blues and greens. It's yeah. yeah probably. And though any colour it seems to darken it slightly. No, it's pretty just light settings. You could probably change it. You probably. Know, it. I should be the expert, shouldn't I? <laughs> Guess well, we're not using your camera again for. Photos. No, videos. That's all oh, sure. It took me nearly a day to get them. That was very annoying. You were oh. so frustrated. But I must check if I can change. It's probably something to do with the format of the video as well. 
It's all very technical and I know exactly what I'm talking about. Not. <laughs> okay, so that's the blue. Now I kind of want the orange just to sort of sit on top first. Do you want to that set up? So I'm going to let it set. So we're going to turn it off now and come back to you when it's set up a tiny bit more. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're back everybody. It looks to be settling up a bit. So I think I shall risk trying the orange layer. I'm just going to stir it beforehand. So I hope everybody had, oh yeah, that's perfect. A good summer. Um, or winter if you're in Australia. Or winter in Australia and New Zealand or whatever. Um, yeah, they'd be glad for their summer to come along, I'd say. Mm -hmm. Their winter is practically the same temperature as our summer. Uh, not quite. Well, about 14, 15 degrees. Sometimes that's all we've been getting. True. Yeah, one or two days. I think I can probably pour this now. Yeah. I think that may have gone down. Yeah, it doesn't matter because it's going to be swirled anyway. Oh, yeah. Yeah, didn't leave blue for the top. Yeah, but we're going to end Oh, yeah, the sort of time. Remember I did that before? Yeah. I did that off the back of the spoon. Why do you do that, actually? Because it disperses the oh, yeah. force of the... Okay. Not being thicker. Good question. <laughs> Get a bit there on your side, just on the edge, just to wipe it off. Oh, here? Yeah, just there. Yeah, it's no, deeper down with your hand. left so thin here I'm a bit worried about that coming out but anyway oh yeah let's not worry too much okay before I do any designs we're going to do the Celine Sorrel so you need a clean spoon go into your soap down to the bottom lift up to the top and bring that bottom up down twirl bottom up down twirl bottom up I do like this And on this side. That's really cool. And the middle, just a bit more. Not too much, don't want to be too muddy looking. And that's it. Bang it out. Gorgeous colours. Now, I think it's still a bit too liquid to um, texture the top. Yeah, but... Uh, do you think? Mm, well, I'll give it a go. Again, I don't want to mix them up too much. Yeah, I think I might have to come back to that and do it once more. So we'll just turn yeah. it off and we'll come back to that in a minute. Okay, so I think this is set up a bit better, yeah. Don't want to poke with it too much as I said. Because I want to be the colours to be nicely defined. It smells really good, doesn't it? Smells gorgeous, right? It's like fresh air or something, really. Yeah. Like when you go on a summer holiday and you smell that mm. clean air. Mm. 
more? Mm, I wouldn't do too much more. It feels more to find out a bit. I think you're right. Yes, I think you're right. Yeah, okay, a bit of glitter, and the glitter on this it kind of shows the sea waves and the sun shining. And the sun did shine. It did. Quite a lot some days. Mmm. You got lovely colours out of it. But we're all sorry. But then you don't go on a holiday in Ireland unless you expect a little bit of rain, to be honest. Something wrong with the rest of us. Or something very, very wrong. Mm. <laughs> if you live here. Yeah. Okay, not too much. Enough? Yeah, missed anywhere? Just over there, I suppose. Yeah. That one's grown, Joe. Perfect. Okay, we don't have a name for this. It'll be something Haven. Um, because that's the name of one of the areas we were beside. Which is called Castle Haven, but Castle no, doesn't quite Castle match Castle Haven. It. Castle Haven is no, the sea. Cross Haven, isn't it? No. Crook Haven. Crook Haven is one of no oh, area. Okay, okay. Well Crook Haven is the area that we were in where we saw this, but that kind of doesn't match the soap. So it'll be something haven. So if you have any ideas, put them down in the comment and tell us and we'll see what we like. Or we might come up with one ourselves, I don't know yet. Um just want to just tidy off that edge there. Very cheap. Oh, oh, there. This one's easier to cut when it's like that. Trim, I should say. Okay. So that's the first soap after holidays and it's something haven. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And it's in tribute to our summer holidays in West Cork in the southwest of Ireland. Hope you enjoy um, and we we'll, should be doing a cutting video then in Wednesday. Wednesday? Yeah. yeah. Wednesday. Okay, Aww. thanks and um, glad to see you missed us. Uh, it's really nice and thanks so much for watching. And thanks a huge bunch to all the new subscribers because there's been tons. And really hope you enjoy the videos. Okay, so it's a big bye, -bye. bye from me and a big... Bye. -ya. From Titchy from iamhamme.com. Bye. -ya. Bye, -ya. Bye -ya.